Hi, everyone. If you're running into issues with a device driver or just want to clean up unused drivers, Windows 11 gives you multiple ways to uninstall them. Whether you're troubleshooting errors, removing outdated drivers, or just freeing up space, knowing how to do this properly can save you a lot of hassle. Now, what exactly is a driver? Think of it as a bridge between your hardware and Windows 11. It ensures that your graphics card, printer, or sound card works smoothly. While Windows usually handles driver updates automatically, sometimes you might need to remove one manually, maybe because it's causing performance issues or you no longer need it. In this guide, I'll show you four easy ways to uninstall drivers on Windows 11. Let's get started. First, using Device Manager, open Start and search for Device Manager, then click the top result. Once inside, find the category with the driver you want to remove, right, click the device, and select Uninstall Device. If you see the option, delete the driver software for this device, check it to remove the driver completely. Finally, click Uninstall. That's it. The driver is now gone. Next, using the Settings app, go to Settings, then click Apps and select Installed Apps. Find the driver from the list, click the three-dot menu next to it, and choose Uninstall. Click Uninstall again to confirm. Keep in mind that some driver components might remain depending on the uninstaller. Now let's move to the Control Panel, open Control Panel, and click Uninstall a Program under the Program section. Find the driver package you want to remove, click Uninstall, and then hit Yes to confirm. Similar to the Settings method, some files may still remain. Finally, using Command Prompt. If you prefer a command line approach, open Command Prompt as an administrator. Type this command and press Enter. This will list all installed drivers. Find the one you want to remove, then type. Make sure to replace publisher name with the actual name of the driver. Press Enter and the driver will be completely removed, preventing future automatic installations. And that's how you do it. Whether you prefer the graphical interface or command line methods, you now have complete control over removing drivers from Windows 11. If you found this guide helpful, stay tuned for more Windows tips and troubleshooting tutorials.